Less than 24 hours remain until the kickoff for weekend lawn copper dog celebration. And even with a lack of snow, organizers are determined to make the event as fun as possible. And TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Colin Jackson spoke with organizers about what kinds of fun attendees can expect and ones that they won't. <laughs> Copper Dog organizers want everyone who can visit Calumet for the weekend to take part in a lineup of events. Friday night begins with a street party on 5th Street alongside a meet and greet hug a husky activity. These include dogs from groups like CD Kennels, Malamutes and Rescues. This is followed by a brand new event, the Copper Drag Race, a 250 foot sprint down 5th Street. We're going to have two shoots set up side by side and we're going to launch two two dog teams. First one down to the end wins that round and we're going to just go through elimination down till we get one winner. Fireworks at 9 in the evening cap off the first day. Saturday, the first ever copper pole weight pole in the UP will be held. An open registration event. Participants can sign up their dogs to see just how much weight they can pull across 16 feet. More and more weight is added per round until only one dog is left standing. In the past, they've seen how fast the dogs go. Now they're going to get to see how much they will pull. This is open to amateur, novice dogs. Anything can pull as long as it's healthy. There will be three pull competitions, with one Saturday morning and two more across Saturday evening and Sunday morning. This is followed by the Copper Dash for children, with participants being able to use dogs from CD Kennels to race. Several other events will be dotted across the weekend outside of the races. Saturday night at the theater at 7 o'clock is going to be Iron Will. Sunday afternoon at 1 is the documentary called Musher, which is about four women um, that have mushed in the copper dog before. Organizers also ask any people who are willing to volunteer to help the weekend run smoothly to speak with them during the event this weekend. Colin Jackson, TV6 News, Calumet.